Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to our first meeting of 2024 of the Rotary Club of Des Moines. I am President Becky Greenwald. You know, you know me, I normally share an up, upwardly happy tidbit or something about uh, Rotary and a factoid. Uh, this morning, I'm not going to talk about the environment as I plan to. I'm going to go off script. I'm from the community of Perry. I've lived there for 30 years. My two kids graduated from Perry High School. have great friends that are the uh, administrators, the staff, students, and children of my friends and my daughters and sons uh, students that have been tragically touched this morning. I'm not going to share any stories that I've heard. I just say I'm grateful that my family and close members um, are able to text me and tell me what's going on. Um, it's a tough day. I'm going to just reflect for a moment, going back to about when the Columbine shooting happened. And I had a high school classmate that lived in that community and had kids in that high school at the time. And I remember being just shocked by that and riveted by it. And then years later, not, not even years later, months later, I was traveling on business in Australia. And we had a, one of my, my uh, peers there was a, a, a big, robust Australian rugby, no, actually it was an Australian football player. And we were having this discussion about what happened in Columbine, and it was so shocking. And I'll never forget, and every time there's a shooting, it reminds me of this conversation we had out in the middle of an alfalfa field, actually, about he looked at me and he said, you know, we had a tragic shooting in Tasmania not long ago, and we did something about it. What's wrong with you Americans? That's exactly what he said to me. And every time I think about that conversation, and I swear I had no idea that I'd be standing here decades later still having those conversations. <laughs> and all I will say is that uh, I was trying to do my part, but I have not done enough. And uh, every time I hear about a tragedy, if it's at a, at a school, which I understand this is the second school shooting this year, and today was the first day of school. So that's kind of shocking. If it's a school, a theater, and a music concert, I always feel thankful that, oh my goodness, at least it wasn't here. Well, this morning I woke up to text and it was here in my community. And I just ask you for a moment to, to give strength and, and consolence to all the members of the Perry community and, and extended families that are going to be touched by this because as the news comes out, um, it, it's just a tragedy that's just too close to home. So just a moment of thought. seen the vulnerable Becky Greenwald and uh, hopefully we don't have to have too many long uh, sessions like this. I do want to change the tone though because this is the new year. Our club is off to a fantastic start the first half of the year. We've got great things in store for us as we go forward into 2024 and we want to get right to our program and here I'm going to ask Randy Burke to come up and give us some inspiration followed by the Pledge of Allegiance and a five-way test. So sorry about that, Randy. I have Kleenex if anybody can. based on the events of the day. This has happened to me twice. I may stop volunteering to do this. <laughs> <clears throat> you'll, you'll catch up. I, I hope I can do it justice. I grew up my first 13 and some odd months years in a small farm community. <clears throat> uh, small if you think 550 people is 